So you may be having an issue on your iPhone where for some reason you're getting this little pop-up that tells you it's enabling to install a certain application because its integrity cannot be verified. Now when you see this, this may look like a very, very random little pop-up and you aren't really too sure what's going on. Well, the main reason why this you know, pop-up is happening is because you're trying to install maybe some third-party applications or maybe even some stock applications that just can't even work anymore. It happens all the time. So the first thing I'd recommend doing is seeing if there's an available certificate. And you can do this by making your way over to your iPhone settings like this. You want to click on your general settings, which is right here. And what you want to do here is you want to scroll all the way down until you see VPN and device management. Now, I am currently on iOS 16.3. It's the latest version. Things can change in the future. It's already changed a couple of times the past few versions of software. So just click here. If it changes, find the one that looks close to it. And what you want to do here is you want to find the specific profile. So in this case, if you just installed a random profile now, you should be able to see that it's the weird looking one or whatever. Go and open it up. And there should be a little install button on the top right. Now, if it allows you to install it properly and like it doesn't give you any errors, then that's basically all you have to do. However, if it is throwing you a random error where it's saying it can't be verified, it can't be verified, or you can't install it, that means the certificate, and this may not make a lot of sense, but just kind of understand it, the certificate in which this application is being installed, it pretty much is no longer available. So certificates, app certificates, sometimes take like, I think they last like two or three weeks. There's been so many workarounds in the past, but basically the main reason why this is happening, if it was working before and it's no longer working, is because that certificate is no longer signed. So you will have to go ahead and pretty much reinstall this application or I guess next time put your phone on airplane mode and try going that way. But that is pretty much the main thing you can do. So you can try installing it via here or you can try going through and seeing if it's available, you know, like another certificate or another app being signed. But that's pretty much how to do it for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.